Why am I running? Well, I haven't put out a lot of positioning on that one, but the story is really personal and very simple. You know, I've been a public defender for 10 years, and being a public defender, I represent the indigent in this county. And just last year, around about October, I was dealing with a gentleman who, he had a horrible drug addiction issue. And I had him in front of my judge, and I was talking to the judge about more treatment. Now, this guy had gone through a lot of treatment. He, he was on his fourth or fifth violation, and what happened was my judge put him away for a couple of years. Uh, it made me realize, you know, I came home and I told my wife what was going on and I said, God, somebody should do something about this. And it made me realize that we don't do enough about it. We, we give them 28 days of treatment. We don't bother with too much follow-up. We don't have good regulations on sober living facilities. So there's no monitoring of their progress. And I've just seen this continually for over a decade of how opioids has destroyed our community. It's eating into the fabric of even, you know, the 166. It's not just an urban issue, and it hasn't been for a long time, but the fact that we don't treat it with the right amount of care is why I decided to run. Um, and then when I get in the race, I started doing a lot more research into other issues that are just core. Uh, we don't have streets paved properly. We don't have stoplight cameras. We don't have a lot of things that our state representative should be bringing here, should be doing for us. We have infrastructural issues that can really only be cured at the state level. And when I took a look at these things, I realized there's a lot of work to be done. And I, I want to go to Harrisburg to do it.